here we go. Nice big salad, a burger, and some of my refrigerator dill pickles that I made from my harvest last fall. If this doesn't remind you of spring, I don't know what does. We had a heat wave today. It was 32. Hey everyone. So I started harvesting and I forgot to bring the camera down. So I'm just going to finish harvesting uh, the lettuce that's all good and ready to go. Uh, I'm going to leave that one in and then I have some more on the floor that uh, I'm going to leave in. Um, but these were the DWC totes. So I'm just going to harvest these. I'm going to pull off some of the old bad leaves on the outside. And there you go. That's a, a pretty nice head of lettuce. I'll do a little cleaning up on the edges. Some of these ones will come off. That one will come off. This one will come off. But yeah, I'm going to cut that up for a salad. That'll probably be enough for a salad for tonight. And I'm also going to harvest this one. This is the little gem butterhead. Because these guys are pretty much out of water. I'm going to have to fill it up for that other one. But uh, these outside leaves tend to, the first, the first set or two tend to be the worst. Then after that, it's, uh, it's not bad. So this will go in the fridge. I'll just wrap this in uh, some paper towel. I won't wash it. And I'll put that in the fridge. And I'll do the same with this one. Between that little gem, this is leaf lettuce. I could cut this and leave it and let it grow again, um, but I'm not doing that. So I'm just going to put these between the next two nights. This leaf lettuce and that little gem. I'll probably throw a little bit of this in with uh, the one I'm going to have tonight. But the leaf lettuce does a lot better uh, as far as edges burning and stuff. So this is a this is a really nice, really nice head of leaf lettuce here. So I'll probably split this up, have half of this tonight with the one head, and have the other half tomorrow. It'll be a big salad, but that's okay. Salad's good for you. Then I don't have to eat so much of the rest of the stuff. But uh, that's it. Just wanted to take you through the quick harvest. The other ones actually went into a plastic... Actually, my, my seed starting muffin tote, I actually took and cut little holes out. You can see this is kind of the remnants of the hole. So I, I cut little round holes to where the two inch net pots would just fit right inside that plastic muffin container. And I put three heads in there and I left a hole in the top so you could fill it with water. And that went to another house. Um, so they're going to have lettuce, they'll have one head of lettuce, and then they'll leave the other two just sitting in about an inch, inch or inch and a half of water in the bottom, and they can let it grow as long as it's by a windowsill, it gets a little bit of light. It should be good for probably a couple of weeks, I would think. So yeah, I'm going to clean these up, I'm going to see what I need to do to get enough water in to support that lettuce growing the rest of the way, and then I'm going to put everything back up, and then I'll show you what it looks like when we're done.
So as you can see, I just dumped a gallon of water in and I threw uh, enough nutrients for one gallon. Um, all this other stuff is fine for now. This is another one that will turn into a head, so it'll be it'll be harvested at once. Let me see what this guy looks like. So these are my little gem butterhead. This one should have enough roots too. We're gonna consolidate. And that should have enough of a root. So these will finish their life out just cracky. Um, no air in those. So we'll just leave them. Um, this one, these are the seeds that didn't germinate in this one. So they'll go. I'm going to have to get ready soon to start my seeds for spring. So we're not going to be able to grow too much more down here. Uh, as far as lettuce is concerned, I'll have to go look and see. I might try one more grow in this tote, but for now, that's going to be like that. Um, I'm just going to cover that hole. Got a little piece of cardboard here. So we'll cover that hole with some cardboard. And then this will slide back, stay under that back light. This tote's going to go. And we'll set up our radishes. Put those back here. And I don't think I'm going to need this light. That light should do fine. I'm going to drop these down just a little bit. And drop this one down a little bit. And there we go. All right, just want to bring you along, show you what I was doing, harvesting lettuce, and then uh, setting up for this. All right, that's it for this one. If you liked the video, please click that like button. Please subscribe, leave me a comment, and until next time, grow something. See ya.